Hello, everybody of the internet. My hair is normally not this poofy. Just letting you know. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys have never seen my face or my videos before, then you guys should hit that subscribe button if you enjoy this video. Um, also, follow all of my social medias, which will be down below. And today, I just did this like half cut crease type of thing. I don't know. I tried to do it. Um, as we know, I'm not good at eyeshadow, so, you know, so let's just get into the video. My camera cut out the part where I was doing my transition shade, so anyways, I used Flower Child and Smarty Pants. Okay, so now I'm going to be taking my tapered blending brush. I have no clue if that's what this is, but it, yeah, okay. Now I'm going to take the shade Sweetheart, and I'm just going to blend that in my crease. So sorry about my hair. I was, let me tell you a story. Let me tell you about how my life has been going lately. So I filmed a video, I think it was three days ago. So I filmed a video, it was like this long get ready with me, you know. I filmed it, I told so many stories, I had a great time. Then I went to import it to my laptop. Half the footage was gone the day before yesterday. I tried filming a different video with eyeshadow, and the eyeshadow turned out terrible. It was another video gone, wasted, because I'm terrible at life. <laughs> um, move on to the next step, so I'm taking this other brush, I don't know, it just looks like this, and yeah. Um, and I'm gonna take the shade Jet Setter, and I'm going to, like, create my crease. So then the next day, I'm up here, like, doing one eye first before I begin filming, and it, like, okay. I took a video, I took a video of this because it was probably the worst eyeshadow I've ever done in my entire life. Okay, everybody, this is how it turned out. Great. Now you can see what I'm talking about. So later, you know, I was like, cool down, I was ready. I filled in my eyebrows and let me tell you, they looked bomb. Like, mm, sorry, but they looked good. So then I was like going to film another eyeshadow look and I did a cut crease. Well, I tried to do a cut crease, and we all know my cut creases just aren't good. Then I took it off, and I was like, you know what, I don't even want to film anymore. So here I am again, trying to film. This doesn't look good, but you know, I just don't even care at this point. Now I'm going to just keep the same brush and use the shade Rebel and go over that, just to define the crease more. So now I'm going to take another Wet n Wild brush. Ooh. And I'm going to take the shade Leader, and with that, um, you're going to start at, like, the end of the crease, the outer crease, and then you're just going to, like, kind of, like, bring it out with the cut crease part. I'm going to tell you guys a story. So, right when I got back from vacation, it was, like, 12 o'clock at night. On the way home, we noticed that I had this, like, thing on my leg. We thought it was a pimple, but... It wasn't. It's like, ugh, I'm so gross. Like, I am, like, such a baby when it comes to, like, that kind of stuff. One time there's an eyelash in my eye, and I was, like, freaking out. I, like, over-exaggerated, and it was, like, crazy. I was like, oh my god, I like, no. Eventually did get the eyelash on my eye, so I'm going to go with this thing. So I got in the bathroom, and I was, like, trying to pop it, and, um, then I started getting dizzy, and I was like, Mom, I'm getting dizzy. And my mom goes, yeah, me too. I was like, no, like, I'm going to pass out. Like, I'm getting dizzy. And so I went out to my kitchen, and I got a glass of water, and I was trying to drink it. And then, like, I start, my vision started getting, like, really blurry. And then I started, like, losing my hearing. And I was like, I think I'm going to pass out. Like, I'm getting really dizzy. My dad goes, go lay down on the couch. So I'm trying to walk out to the couch. And I just kept running into the wall, like, over and over again. I just lay down on the floor, and then I, like, blacked out. And it was crazy. Now it's time to cut the crease, and I'm just going to use this little Eco Tools brush and this Maybelline Age Rewind stuff, and I'm just going to cut the crease, but only halfway, because this is a half-cut crease. Now I'm going to take another Wet n Wild brush. And I'm going to set it. So now I'm going to go back in with that same Wet n Wild brush. I'm going to go back in with Leader and create a gradient so that it looks blended. Now I'm going to start on my face makeup using this Duop Cosmetics Foundation of Youth. Um, because it's the only foundation that's dark enough for me at the moment. Because 
I'm kind of losing my tan from the beach, but like not. I'm blending it with my Real Techniques Beauty Blender. So many pimples on my chin right now, it's freaking annoying. Okay, now I'm gonna take uh, my Maybelline Insta A Rewind Concealer. Now I'm gonna take my cocaine, I mean powder, and I'm gonna bake my face. And to set the rest of my face, I'm using my Real Techniques powder brush. The Real Techniques sculpting brush, and I'm using my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil bronzer. We're gonna bronze my face. For highlighter, I'm using the Mary Luminizer from the Balm. And okay, so now, um, for my under eyes, I'm just gonna mix every shade that I used in my eyeshadow. Now I'm gonna be taking my Maybelline Pumped Up Colossal Volume Express and my Maybelline Colossal Volume Express. Okay, so the last step for lips, um, I'm using the Dolce K and Coco K, the lip liners from Kylie Cosmetics. I'm gonna mix them together to put them on my lips. Um, look how poofy my hair is, I look like a lion. I'm gonna let my hair calm down a little bit and then I'll do my intro and outro. Okay guys, so my hair is still super poofy but I just don't feel like waiting for it to calm down because I just wanna like edit this video, you know, get it up as soon as possible for you guys. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, then give it a thumbs up and also um, let me know if you like the longer videos or the more like short videos that I normally do. Um, so yeah. Follow all my social medias, which will, as always, be in the description box. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!